Hello, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we're going to install the C4 accessory tray on our Forerunner. So we're going to basically relocate this boxes into this one. So come on, let's proceed. So first, uh, we're going to talk about the C4 accessory tray. Uh, this is going to be enough uh, for my use uh, because I don't really do any off-roading really. Uh, so, but I want some lights so so that I can see those parking lot curbs. Uh, but yeah, so here we go. So I'm just going to transfer uh, my box here, this accessory box. Uh, for, for my switch panel and also my bright box. So we're just gonna transfer them here. So first we're going to, uh, well, I'm not gonna paint this one out right now. Uh, we're just gonna install it uh, temporarily then uh, to see how it looks, then we can have it painted. So with the packaging, it includes the hardware that you need to install this one out on your forerunner again this one ships out spare if you want to get it powder coated feel free to do that or if you want to get it painted yes so let's me let me show you for the 2022 2020 and up you'll have this extra box in here uh, this will be on the way so you have to unscrew this one out and then you have to remove the bracket in here straighten that one out and you can remove that harness in there that black thing that's holding the harness you can unclip that and then you move the bracket over there and plug this one in there so just to give enough space uh in here for the tray and for the tray also it will have this you stand in here which you need to unbolt that thing in there not yeah just uh, just loosen it up just enough space to slide that uh bracket or stand for the tray and then just screw it again and then just finish it off uh yeah so let's proceed all right so we got the bracket uh, remove basically this is the holder for the fuse and relay that extra one in there we remove uh, we unclip that harness so again with this one we flatten this one out as much as I can so this will give us enough room to put this one out in there all right so let's proceed okay so we relocate the fuse holder uh, our fuse box in here so yeah so now we're going to start with the tray by removing that 10 millimeter bolt on that area let's go all right so here you go the c4 tray is installed so yeah everything looks good in here again this is enough uh, for my use basically and i just need to transfer this to in here yeah looking good all right and there you go guys so if you find this video helpful please consider subscribing thank you for watching